Edgar saved my life. I used to live in Chaldeum, you know. The penitent butchers swept through my corner of the city and killed almost everyone I knew. There was a confrontation in the ranks of the knights. I only saw part of it, but it was violent. Edgar left the order that day. By nightfall, he was guiding a handful of us across the desert to safety, and he's been returning to rescue more people ever since. I don't think he sleeps. He was one of them, yes, and maybe he was a killer once, but I believe people can change. I have to believe that. I've never met the man. I just know that Edgar fears him. And Edgar isn't afraid of anything. Osric led the group of Inquisitors who accompanied the knights into Chaldeum. He must have been someone important back up north, or had dirt on someone. It's personal with Osric now. He can't stand the thought of one of his charges leaving the Faith. He'll never let Edgar walk away. Edgar has been hiding people from the Knights, inside some abandoned buildings south of Chaldeum. We thought they would be safe there, but no one is safe from Osric and his Inquisitors. He'll never stop hunting them. Will you go and help Edgar? He wasn't always good, but what he's doing now is... He deserves a chance to atone for his sins. I need more time. This is my fault. I should never have left them here alone. This is Osric's doing. I watched him butcher innocents in Chaldeum, and instead of stopping him, I walked away. I used to be a knight. You probably figured that out already. I left the day I rescued Suna. I should have saved more. If I had killed him instead of fleeing the city, these people might still live. I will flee no longer. I'm going back in for Osric, if it costs me my life. Well, I owe that much and more. I'll meet you there. Very well. Let us deliver justice together. Gather what you need and meet me in the bazaar outside the Chaldean gates. That bastard will pay for what he's done. <laughs> 